Hey guys, welcome back. Well, we all know what kind of like spring fever is. And just as Nick and I were talking about earlier, when spring does come, there's a lot of different things that are blowing around and can make you some things a little irritated. And that's why we have Mr. Trevor Miller joining us this week. He's with the Advanta Clean to talk about how to combat what's known as spring sickness. So Trevor, first off, thank you so much for joining us this morning. We're continuing kind of like our health segment with you. Um, and I understand you have some tips for us. Yes, ma'am. Yeah, I appreciate you guys having us on. They say that your indoor air is actually three to seven times more contaminated than the, than the outdoor air you breathe. So the reason we wanted to come on today is kind of give you some tips and pointers um, on how you can try to improve your indoor air quality. Absolutely. Uh, one of the most important things that you can do and that we recommended at Vanity Clean is leave your shoes out the door. Uh, think about the places you go throughout the day, whether it's your place of business, maybe walking through the mall, a Texas Tech sporting event, a public restroom. I mean, you go through several dirty places throughout the yeah. day. <laughs> and the studies show that 90% of the stuff that you pick up on the bottom of your shoes throughout the day is actually transferred to your hard they surfaces. Stick with you. Yes. Oh, gosh. They transfer it to your hard surfaces and your carpet in your home. So at Advantage Clean, we recommend if you can, leave your shoes at the door, maybe slip into some slippers or some no slip socks, especially if you have small children or infants that are going to be low to the ground and, and mobile. Uh, you want to make sure you're leaving your shoes at the door would be our first tip. Good stuff. All right. And what are some other things? You have some cool props here. Yeah. So outside of leaving your shoes at the door, uh, one of the other things we recommend is when you get out of the shower or you're taking a bath, dry off in the shower or bathtub because if you get out of the shower while you're still dripping wet, these bath mats are going to catch and contain all that moisture. Mm -hmm. um, you know, when the bath mats are damp and they contain that moisture, that's just a breeding There's ground a lot for of mold and other bacteria. Yeah. Yes, ma'am. So, uh, so first, leave the shoes at the door. Okay. Second is dry off. Um, we have the towel here. You want to make sure you're hanging your towels properly. If you're putting on a hook, just laying it on the ground. Those creases and folds in the towels, again, moisture is the common denominator. Ground, like you said. Yes, ma'am. There's no other way, I think, to put that in words that makes it sound as gross as it truly is. Yes, ma'am. So that kind of creates awareness. So these are good tips and uh, uh, clearly not just stuff that we can implement in our schedule during the springtime, just year, year round. Yes, ma'am. Yeah, and one of the things we strongly recommend at Advantage Clean and, and even the EPA recommends is having your air ducts professionally cleaned ever so often. That Advantage Clean we recommend about every other year um, because that becomes a breeding ground as well. You know, they say in the average household, a six-bedroom house, uh, 40 pounds of dust is created annually just through everyday living, whether that's skin follicles, pet dander, hair. Um, and that's just being sucked into your ventilation system. So, you know, they recommend getting your air ducts cleaned every so often. And uh, at Advanced Clean, we are NAFCA certified, which is your National Air Duct Cleaning Association. Um, but, you know, we run special whips and brush it through there to disturb that dust, break it up in, you know, high uh, vacuum systems to, you know, pull all that out of the air and just really take the steps necessary in order to, to improve your indoor air quality. Very good. All right, Trevor. Well, thank you so much for coming on. Awesome tips. And, guys, we're going to have those up on our website later on for y'all at home at everythinglubbock.com. Trevor, thank you so much. Thank this you for having great. me. Yes,